But what happened was that he, he, he'd been warned three times he'd split the trousers. You know, these velvet trousers, and they split. And if you wear it, don't wear underpants, you're going to be in trouble, aren't you? And I can remember quite clearly that night, there was Joe Collins, uh, Sissy Williams from Moss Empires, Stan Fisherman from Rank, and some guy from ABCs. They were the people that controlled all the theatre. So well, I went to his apartment uh, with his agent, a fellow called Tony Lewis, and Tony Lewis worked for John Heyman. And John Heyman, it was a secondary thing in his office because he managed Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton, so he didn't really, he wasn't particularly interested that much in PJ Proby. And now Proby was becoming to become a bit of a thorn in his agency's side. So we got there at 11 o'clock. At 12.30, he eventually came down. Bottle of Shivers Regal in one hand and some bird in the other. Hi, Mervyn. Great to see you. Great show. I said, yeah. And, we, and I'm sitting like this in the room. And he comes in and he says, well, it's a great show. And I said, yeah, it was a great show. I said, but tonight will be the last show for you. I said, because if you do it again tonight, you will be out of the business. Oh, no, 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 I promise you this, that, and the other. No. We come to the show. He does exactly the same thing again. Not only did they drop the curtain, but they in the theatres at that time, they had an iron curtain, and they dropped that on him as well. <laughs> he never performed again, really years after that and at that time Tom Jones had just got in the charts and he was number three then it's not unusual I think it was the first major hit he had and uh, we put him on but he he wasn't you know he he was he was good but it was a bit early days I did the first concert with the who at um, I got the poster upstairs actually I just tweaked it out actually it was um, they were on with The Bachelors. They were the opening act. I paid them £35. <laughs> but that's show business.